there is uh, no hard and fast answer as to when uh, you should raise money, when you need to get your incubator, when you need to get your accelerator. I think this is something which you evaluate each, op each opportunity that comes along. That to get into an incubator, this is what I'm giving up, and this is what I'm going to gain. Uh, to get into an accelerator, this is what I'm giving up, this is what I'm going to gain. And you take that call uh, in that manner. Um, certainly, incubation and acceleration has many advantages. You get mentoring, perhaps you get some money, you get office space. More importantly, you get a network of other startups. And it, you know, to some extent, I think uh, being around other entrepreneurs is uh, gives you ideas. It, it is infectious, uh, you know. And 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 it is, otherwise, it can be a very very lonely journey. I think an entrepreneur's job is very lonely. Uh, today, if you have an option to meet other entrepreneurs and, and talk to them about stuff, I think it's a good idea. I think it's about quality of mentorship. I think it's about some track record. I think it's about the credentials of the uh, people running the incubator. I think it's about what kind of network will they give you? Uh, will they connect you to enough investors and the right investors? Will they connect you to enough customers? Will they advise you on technology? Will they advise you on product? Will they help you hire people? Uh, I think it's all those things.